Hiya, welcome back to my channel. So this week I thought I would share with you what's in my nappy changing bag. Nappy changing bag, do we call it a nappy changing bag or a nappy bag? The bag we carry when we have babies. Anyway, now I don't actually have a proper nappy changing bag. When we were buying stuff for Talia this this like this pregnancy, we just it was one of the things we just didn't end up buying. And we also had a bag anyway that we used to carry around for Ayla with just bits and bobs in. Um, and that lovely bag is this. Yes, I carry around a bright yellow minion bag with everything in it. Um, so I will start going through it. So the first thing I have in my bag is always my purse um it pretty much lives in this bag i have two bags i have this bag and i have another bag um the other bag doesn't often come out with me because it's just an extra thing to carry so all i need is my cards and whatnot money in there so that just slips straight into here and then underneath that i'll often have um just a large muslin because I'm breastfeeding at the moment I don't need any bottles or anything like that um, just me so just to cover up I will have a large sorry it's creased don't often do iron in this house anymore so everything's creased it's a very large one and it's just so when I'm out I can just cover myself up um, just to not expose things that I don't want exposed. Um, also as well, especially in this heat, I and the sun so bright and, and beaming down and so hot, um, I like to keep Talia covered up because she's only a baby, she's still young and I just like to make sure that she's not getting burnt by the sun or anything like that. Next thing down is always the nappies and the wipes because after breastfeeding it's often a nappy needs changing. So we. I often take about two or three nappies out if it's just a pop to the shops. But if we're out for a full day, it tends to be about five, six, maybe seven nappies um, because you just never know how many nappies they're going to go through. And then wipes as well. We like to take out a full packet of wipes. Talia's sitting here and she did just pass wind. That wasn't me. We like to take out a full pack of wipes because we go through wipes so quickly. Um, you know, we don't just use them for wiping bottoms, we use them for wiping hands, wiping faces, wiping... That was her again, that was not me. Yeah, wiping hands, wiping faces, um, um, wiping down tables, chairs, whatnot, anything, um, if there's any spillages. So, we take, put them in. Right, now the next thing down, I do go in order with a bag as well. Um, the least, uh, the things we don't aren't likely to need go to the bottom of the bag and the more we need them, the higher up they are. Um, so yeah, then it is spare clothes. Now because it's summer, we really don't have much in there for Talia except for a couple of vests, just because that's all she's wearing at the moment. Because it's so hot, I don't want to layer her up. In the winter, there will be a few more layers in there for her, but now, no point. Um, and then we have some spare clothes for Ayla. Now she is potty trained, but um, we do like to carry some spare knickers and some spare trousers and bits because just in case, really. You never know, we might not be able to get in the toilet quick enough and she might have a little accident, so we do carry them. Now as well with the weather, it's so hot at the moment, but you never know in this country whether it's gonna rain 10 seconds after it's sunny or not so we do carry some leggings and we also do have a pair of shorts in um if we're going on a small trip just to the shops as part there is just no point having um extra tops in there sometimes we do put extra tops in if we go into something messy um but otherwise it's just the bottoms for just in case or just in case the weather changes and then we also have in nappy cream um we this wouldn't normally be at the bottom um it is just in the bottom because it just falls there so often what i end up having to do is is dig right down mess up the whole bag um and find it which is really irritating because then i can't get everything back in again but that's the way it goes then i have in there a pad and a pen I like making lists, I like writing lots of stuff down. There is a difference between writing a list on paper to writing a list on your phone. I feel like I just remember more when I've written it down. Um, 
so that is what I do. I just like it there. Often I don't even use it, but it's there anyway. The second from last thing is hairbands. We like to have hairbands in there because when Ayla gets a bit hot, I just like to put her hair up. Often itches. It's just at about this length at the moment, so it often itches the back of her neck when she gets a bit hot. So I like to just put it in a little bum, 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 bun, just so um, if she gets a little bit hot, we can put it up. And then last but not least is a red book. I used to always carry Ayla's with her, and I don't think I've only just just stopped carrying Ayla's when Talia was born. Um, there was something said to me that when that when Ayla was a baby, that you must carry the red book everywhere, and it's just stuck with me. So Ayla's we don't take out anymore, but Talia's we do, so that it's always with her, just in case we might need it. Which I guess if she was to go into hospital, I'm assuming they'd have her details anyway, because that's where she was born. Um, but just in case it's got all our details in it so yeah so that is everything that I put in my bag oh no forgetting one thing it wasn't in the bag it was next to it because Ayla had it um, it's her juice bottle we like to have some juice in there just slid down the side for her because it is so hot at the moment and when we go out she'll often be like I want some juice um, and if we don't have it we often just buy her a little bottle of water or some fruit juice anyway um, but it's just cheaper to put that in there. So yeah, that is what is in my bag. Hopefully in the next few weeks I will get a proper changing bag um, because it, I want something a little bit more stylish than a big minion, big bright yellow minion bag. I am looking for a rucksack nappy changing bag though so if you have any recommendations please pop them in the comment box below if you like my videos please give it a thumbs up and i'd love for you to subscribe and i'll see you next week bye